Thank you very much for clicking on my video. A quick word before we begin. If you are new to Trove or wish to start a new account, feel free to use the first link in this video's description. You'll help the channel greatly. What's up guys, welcome back to Trove, welcome back to my main account, but most importantly, welcome back to yet another Luxion landing. I hope to get as much mastery as before, last um, episode of Luxion happened like 14 days ago, and I actually managed to get like 50 mastery points on both main and alt. Hope the same is gonna happen today, and only one way to find out, nothing impressive honestly from this inventory, and as a matter of fact I think we already have the results. I don't think I'm gonna get any mastery points from today, but anyway, we, uh, we we should probably still check everything out, starting with the first one, first thing in here, the uh, Saint Cubes Lake Ally. For 60 coins you can get like 20 mastery points? <laughs> anyway, it says a hero always rises to face the encroaching shadows, and that hero apparently is this Saint Cubes Lake, which looks... If I find it... Oh my god, it's only 10 mastery points, god damn. Saint Cubes League, power rank 75, good power rank at least. One superstition, wait. Yeah, it's the maximum power rank an ally can give you actually. Right, so one superstition, 50 magic, find a hero, yeah, we already read that, 10 mastery points. This is what the ally looks like anytime now. He sure likes to take his time, but there you have it. And this is the dance animation. The ally comes with a pretty cool one, honestly, I like the uh, shield and sword detail, a pretty good looking ally, although not necessarily a fan, so you will not see it from me ever again. Next, Shimming Shamrock, this is another ally for 70 coins, uh, dragon coins that is, you will get um, another 10 mastery point ally I believe. It says sometimes when no one is looking, he does a little dance of joy. I trust their word on that. Shimming. Shimming Shamrock, there you go. 10 more mastery uh, points from this. And power rank of 75, 7% 7 attack speed, 1.5% critical hit. 10 mastery points, yeah. As I previously mentioned, the ally looks like this. It's actually, uh, it's actually smaller. And speaking of dance, what does it dance like? Then... I guess, yeah, what does it dance like? Okay, it's just gonna be wobbling left and right. Cool, cool. Next, we have a Mega Rider Cardboard Coaster. Okay, 45, cheapest. Okay, cheapest thing in here so far. 45 um, coins for something that may actually have good chances at giving you 50 mastery points. It says, powered by pure imagination. Okay. Where's the mount? Oh, there you go. <laughs> Had trouble locating the mount button cardboard coaster. What? Is this one right? Yes, so this is 50 mastery points. Probably the best deal. Dude, this is... Usually best deals from Luxion are uh, quantified in one-to-one -one ratios. This is even better than a one-to-one -one ratio. And by that I mean you get to spend less coins then you get mastery points back. That rarely happens. Anyway, let's see what the um, the mount, uh, the, the Mag Rider looks like. It looks just like this. I don't think it has any VFX though. Look at this beautiful sky. Oh my god, look at this beautiful sky. Okay, stop shouting. Um, <laughs> notes to self. I wanna play some rails. So I can showcase some potential VFX if it has any. Oh, it does. Yeah, the default. Oh my god, look at this. Look at this. If you're wondering about the sky, and this is off topic, check out my future Mad Sunday video. That's all I can say. Wait for it. I would just hop on the Steam Workshop and you'll probably figure out why I found in there. But yeah. Uh, yeah, so it has some very basic uh, VFX, the bluish. Particle effects all Mega Riders have, I think. But anyway, moving on. So that's the best deal. Dude, I'm just gonna say this is um, the best Luxion deal ever. Because I think it is. Because I don't remember ever a, 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 um, a better ratio, mastery-wise, than one-to-one. -one. 
This cardboard coaster is the best mastery deal from uh, Luxion. I think the best mastery deal Luxion ever brought. If you are to judge strictly by how many coins you spend for how much mastery gain uh, you gain. Anyway, uh, let's go on to the uh, Bone Weaver. This is a 70 coins mount. It says, spins its web with silk and bone. A gloomy tapestry to call a home. Oh, that's nice. Very well written description. Rhymes and all that. Bone Weaver. 50 master points, okay. Uh, I don't think there's anything else to mention, but to show it to you, and this is of course a spider mount, as the description hinted towards. It definitely hinted at this being a spider. And there you have it. No VFX sets whatsoever uh, from this. Should probably change back to my Ernie, there you go. Yeah, so no VFX whatsoever coming from the spider, but it's just a cute little spider mount you can uh, ride on. If you don't have anything else cooler, I suppose. Yeah, finally, musical mat. Okay. I think, oh, I, I think this is 100 master points. Let's find out. So it says, a little traveling music, please. Okay. 120 uh, musical mat. I think it's, a, yeah, it's 100. This is, this is another fairly decent deal right here from the musical mat. Even though, look at this, it's still not a one-to-one -one ratio. It's worse than a one-to-one -one ratio in the favor of um, the coins you have to spend right so musical mat he also flies and that's why it gives 100 this is what it looks like oh i like i like the fact it has a trail i forgot about that i definitely know this i also like the uh, circles vfx circles it leaves um once you jump and this is it flying Yep, fairly nice. I think I I most like the um I like the uh, trail most. What is happening? What? <laughs> Interesting. I'm not gonna bother this guy. I'm gonna just leave him be. Um, right. So this is the musical mat with a very beautiful trail. And that is it from Luxion this week. You have the uh, style stashes as always. I think I should probably check if I'm uh, if I'm able to unlock anything from the style stashes. Okay, so I have a couple of style stashes with me here, and unfortunately, no, no mastery coming from those either. In my case, but you should pro probably buy them if you. Um, I mean, you can loot collect them back into the exact coins you spend, so you risk nothing. If you're uns if you're uncertain. If you have anything um, left from these, just buy them, test them out, and if it's gonna say the same thing it says uh, to me, just loot collect those. Anyway, Binding Darkness is what's next, I'm just gonna completely ignore that. I don't think it's that uh, great of a deal. And finally, the Golden Horde Dragon Souls. I mean, buy these if you desperately need those, don't get me wrong. Finally, the Golden, the golden Horde Dragon Souls, which, if you already have Luxarian, no point in buying those, but if you don't have Luxarian, you should probably buy them. Right, guys, that's gonna be it for today. Thank you so, so much for watching. This has been the entire Luxion uh, inventory showcased. Hopefully, this was helpful to you, and I will see you on the next one. Thank you very much for watching this video. Remember to like it if you enjoyed it, dislike it if you did not, and don't forget to leave a comment saying, well, anything that crosses your mind. This will help the channel greatly. I'll see you on the next one.